Hi, I'm David Talbot, and I'm here to show you some of the basic equipment that we need to grind chainsaws. And some of the equipment besides the grinder itself, I'm going to first off show you what we need to have in the trailer or the equipment that we have with us before we uh, start grinding. I will start by showing you we have to have clean chains, and I use a surfactant like this. It's a uh, non-flammable uh, cleaner, and that can be put in a paint tray is what I use, and use it to in a small wire brush to clean our chains off to begin with so that we can see all of the components of the chains. Another piece that's really important are some Sharpies, and I like different colors because the colors will allow us to identify different problems or if we are with our starting point or if we have problem points on our chain that we can identify them as we grind. Now one of the other parts that's really important is to understand the pitch. Now we'll talk about pitch here in a minute, but pitch tells us what size of grinding wheel that we need. And we measure it with a gauge like this that has, and I'll show you how to use it. Then we have a raker gauge set that sets the proper height of rakers and the way to grind the top of the, of the raker flat. Then we also need to have our safety equipment, goggles. After you've handled chains long enough, you'll want to have a pair of gloves on. And we like to, because we're handling different chainsaw teams and different groups, we have to have some way of tagging the uh, chains to keep each group segregated from another group. And I'll talk more about the uh, calipers are useful to check the length of teeth. But one of the more important parts and what makes this all possible for us is the advent of the CBN uh, grinding wheel. These grinding wheels are set in different size. There's an eighth of an inch uh, diameter uh, or radius cutting surface on one size, and there's a 3 16th, which is bigger, on the other side. And so this covers the different size chains that we use here in TBM. Now, the CBN stands for cubic uh, boron nitride. And this material is second hard to diamonds when it comes to grinding, grinding material. So it doesn't load up and it doesn't change its shape. And it doesn't burn the chains like a conventional grinding stone would. So this is the big plus that makes grinding chains for TBM possible. Well, that's a wrap up of the equipment that we need to look at besides the grinder before we go out on deployment.